You may already know about Daydream VR, which is available on a number of phones, and it's coming to more phones like Samsung Galaxy S8. But you might not know about Tango, which is Google's augmented reality platform. And that has some new features that are here at Google's developer conference. So this is our constructor application. You can see we can uh, make a new scan. So this is actually showing the, the depth information, the point cloud. If we click the record button, um, we can actually start scanning the environment. So you can see that it's making a 3D model of the room as he moves it uh, around. And then if we stop, uh, we can run an optimization as well that'll make it a little bit better. So now you can, you can kind of see, especially if you look at the picture on the wall, and kind of zoom in there, we got half a person in there. <laughs> yeah, this is a model that, that we created earlier of a house. So we can use this to do things like compositing of virtual objects into real physical scenes, and also um, proper occlusion, um, and we can make virtual characters run around your environment because we know uh, what the geometry of that environment looks like. Um, and this one is all about kind of having fun by bringing characters into the real world. So AI actually has this uh, 3D scanner. Um, and so they can scan people um, and other objects and, and actually bring them into the world. So this is a guy dancing, uh, but I can make him really small and I can move him over there. And you can see I could take video with my friends or put myself in it. So here I've got my Sims uh, landscape and you can see I can you know, zoom in on the pool and zoom in on this uh, seal here. Uh, but then I can also go into a first person view um, and we can actually start walking through space and as we get to a door it opens uh, and now we're just kind of walking through this uh, virtual house. And eventually Tango and Daydream VR are going to fuse and you might start seeing stuff that feels like a combination of AR and VR down the road. We'll have to see.